All right, guys, I am back, and I think you were seeing this on Tuesday, which would be the 13th. So, happy Valentine's Day Eve. For those of you who love love, I'm still kind of a skeptic at the moment, but no, I'm teasing. I do believe in love. Um, I don't know what that's going to bring me to in this world, but we'll see. I guess I, I'm keeping the faith alive that, that there is that one special guy out there for me. Um, and all in due time, right? All in due time. I know what I have to do, and, um, it's not easy to do, right? Like, we really have to, um, we have to know what we want, right? And I think I struggle with, um, my people pleasing skills <laughs> and I try to please others versus like, <clears throat> you know, you always reflect back and I've always done what I thought people wanted me to do and worried whether people liked me or not versus being who I am and the right people will like me. I don't know if you guys can, um, you know, uh, identify with that. I think, I think there's more of us out there like that than, than we realize. Um, <clears throat> so, yep, that is my goal for the next couple of months is to really figure out what I'm looking at for in a person, how I want to be treated, how, you know, um, how, how I want to be as a partner, right? Like how I want to show up in relationships. Um, and I guess that's probably with friendships too, right? Um, excuse me. Um, I have to tell you, um, I knew there's a, I think I told you guys about this last summer. I know I'm totally like squirreling out on you guys today. Anyways, um, I saw on Facebook the other day that Hooks, um, a local fish truck, um, was going to be at Jack's today. And, um, I'm not usually a girl who eats a lot of fish or will actively seek out a fish dish unless it's salmon and then all bets are off because I love salmon and I like seafood. So, but all that to say, um, so I saw that Hooks was going to be at our local Jack's, um, which is like a feed store. And I know before you guys get all like worried about <laughs> truck, like <laughs> truck food, um, it's really good, right? Like it is literally like the best fish fried fish sticks I've ever had in my life. So I was like, yeah, I'm going to leave a little bit early for church today and I'm going to go get me some, um, uh, hooks. So that's what I did. And it was delicious. Only, um, those of you who are menopausal will know when I say the heartburn is real because <laughs> it's real. Um, having real issues with it tonight. Um, so, I mean, every time I have fried foods, I'm reminded of, of my age. Um, so not great, <laughs> but we're dealing with it. <laughs> then, oh, there we go. We just got to turn it around. Okay. So four go to each one. Four. Are you watching or listening to ghost stories? Oh, we missed one. Rather, I missed one earlier. Um, so Gracie likes this, um, it's like this station on YouTube that tells ghost stories or like things that freak people out. Like, you know, like weird, bizarre stories, like at hotels or whatever. I don't know. Her mom's kind of chicken little. So. <laughs> um, I typically don't listen when she's listening. 
but it sounds like that guy's voice, so. Ooh, ooh, look at him go. Now I'm just wor wondering and a little bit worried that these might still be just a tiny bit too big. So we'll do one. And these are just those like flashcard rings we all had as uh, kids in school. So, and they all, yeah, it's supposed to just flip, flip through. And so it does. All right, cool. All right, but let me, um, I'm going to put the video on pause for a second. I'm going to go get the bin that has these and see if I have anything smaller. Hold on. Okay. I did find a couple of smaller ones in here, so let's try these instead. So, um, how are y'all doing? Oh yeah, those are, I like those better. Yep, okay. I haven't decided yet what kind of decorations we may or may not do. Do we glitz them up? Get through a little bit of lace on them. Gussy them up just a tiny bit. fingers. Oh no, part of me, since they're, and I don't mean this in a negative intonation, but since they're simpler guys, part of me likes the simplicity of them, but I think I kind of might like some uh, decoration on them too, right? Two of the guys I talked to thought it would be a cute idea, so they would probably be interested in that. Sorry, something just didn't look right. Just making sure it was kind of lined up. <laughs> oh, I do like them. Aren't they sweet? Who among us wouldn't love to have these, right? Aw, so cute. Oh, they're so cute. Now, now let's see. Um, I mean, we could like literally go like crazy crazy on these like the one this one we could let me just see what it would look like because these are more like vertical I thought I used to have an open one of these but I may have used it all up or it might have been one that I lost in the shuffle of things. Let me just cut it open and see what we get. That looked crazy on the edge or maybe on this edge. Yeah, because it covers up the love, so it's just a little it's a little too much. Yeah. It's a little too big. Oh well. No worries. That's a maybe. Or have some dollar store with some fuzz on it. I think these might actually be too big too. I think they might distract from what's really going on. Yep. Yeah. Yep, yeah, not caring for that.
Hmm. I was really thinking a minute ago was maybe, maybe we, uh, I don't know, put some glitter on them. But that would take a whole lot of Mod Podge, I think. More than I want to do. They're cute though, huh? I think I used these like the very first year I got them in shaper cards. I bet you Gracie still has hers. I know Bo probably, he's not really a card keeper, but Gracie sure keeps everything. I think that's a girl thing, isn't it? I remember I made my ex uh, a uh, camel one. <laughs> isn't it funny the things you remember? Hmm, what about these? I don't know, maybe I'm just, maybe we ought to just put on some, those, I like those, but they're just like out there and I don't have any, cause that would be kind of cute to maybe even, you know, hang it as like a charm, right? Do like a little bow and a charm, but I don't have anything that would hold like, you know, I can you do you guys know what I'm talking about? One of those um like teacup typey loop things at the top. I don't think I have any of that. Hmm. Well, oh my goodness. Look what I just found. <laughs> now that I'm done, remember that one that I said I had? Happy Valentine's Day, and I spent so much time looking for it. <laughs> Yeah, that's awesome. Oh, I think I just don't have anything that I would want to use on there as far as like Valentine's Day related. But I was wondering if we had, I mean, we could do like some vintage laces and stuff. Do we even like that? Or should we keep them simple? Oh my goodness, another video where I can't decide. Sorry, ladies. I don't know, I think I think I like the simplicity of them. So maybe what we do is we go back to the old standard thing of the things I'm loving. And let's just see what it would look like on this one, because this one I'm sure um, can handle some of the glitter. But I don't know. I just feel like the guys, since they're they're um, maybe considering it a little bit, would appreciate them not being overdone. Because most of these guys, there's only one in there that I could say would probably love, like, bigger the better. See, I don't even really, I'll finish this one out, but I really don't even like the glitter on these ones. I know, somebody call the police. Dita doesn't like glitter on these. What? That's like blasphemy, isn't it? Yeah, I think, I mean, and I, like I said, I don't, I'm not crazy about it on that one either. So I think, honestly, I think they're done. Um, and I probably should have listened to my first gut instinct, right? Um, for it, but I just, I think those are cute. And so obviously I know you guys know the love coupons, right? And I'm good for, and then they can write whatever they want and they've got four of them. So hopefully they use the four judiciously um, 
and yeah so there is all six of them oh I love these I love each and every one of them and now I've got to decide do we do a couple more little Valentine's Day like ephemera pieces with this kit because there's some really cute stuff still in there I don't know guys I just don't know all right so I know this one's a little bit shorter of a video but um they are done so yeah just like a recap um took me like a week week and a half to make you guys some cards and some love coupons but um yeah I think I don't know I'm gonna just sit, sit with it for a minute and I'm not sure if I'm gonna go ahead and um do a couple more like ephemera pieces to finish out Wednesday or if we're gonna call it good for this little Valentine's Day love season or what um but I guess tomorrow's video will just be a surprise for you because I know starting um the following day I'm gonna use um uh Amy at Crafty Cat's new kit the um wearing of the green and it's beautiful so oh you know what i didn't think of i don't know what we're doing the next video and yes we're gonna keep we are going to keep going a bit maybe all right never mind just pretend i didn't say anything but yeah but like thursday we'll be starting off with um the wearing of the green kit and i'll show it to you and then we'll make some ephemera that first video um so yeah I hope you guys are all doing well, and I hope your um, Tuesday is going absolutely smashing, and we will just talk to you soon. Bye, guys.